Extractions can change the profile of your face, it can change the way you look. There's been studies done on twins where some had extractions with ortho and some didn't and they looked completely different. The patient with the extraction not looking quite as nice. So this is really exciting for us that cases that may have been extractions or even jaw surgery, those invasive technologies or techniques don't need to be done with fast braces. With fast braces we don't extract teeth. We make room for the teeth. I think it makes a huge difference. Rather than having a child who's scared to come in because they may need teeth to be taken out and be, me being told to do that by someone else, having the option of not taking teeth out, giving them a, an amazing smile at an affordable cost is something that makes me, you know, it very, very it excites me greatly. God gave you those teeth for a reason and if you don't have to move them, it's better to leave them there and work with them. And we find that makes your smile uh, much better, more rounded, keeps your facial profile the way it should be. And of course, most patients don't work their teeth pulled anyway. I never agreed with the philosophy of taking teeth out to make other teeth straight. It seems more often than not to cause problems in the long run. When I was younger, most people had two to four of their teeth extracted because they were told they didn't have enough room. That's not the case. You have enough room for all your teeth, that's why you have all your teeth. Now we're allowed, with this technology, to make the the area bigger to fit your teeth in there. You don't have to have them extracted. You don't have to go through the time, the pain, the recovery of having your teeth extracted. I think um, that's a groundbreaking aspect to fast braces is, is not having to extract teeth. Um, and I, you know, I don't think I'll ever want to extract another tooth again for orthodontic reasons. Um, I can't see a need to. When you use a system that is gentle and, and that still moves extremely rapidly and efficiently, causes very little sensitivity but allows you to grow bone. Um, there really aren't too many things available that let you do that. And because of that, we're able to make more room faster and get teeth into the arch without actually having to remove teeth. It's another way of creating space that before we used to have to pull teeth. We just don't do that anymore. I like to keep all the teeth in the mouth as much as I can. I like that full white smile that everybody wants nowadays. Um, as people start to realize you no longer have to have teeth taken out and it, you can do this so much faster and so much quicker, it, it's only a matter of, of months before you know every dental surgeon is doing this and a, a lot of it. Yes, we've always had a problem having to take very good healthy teeth that we've actually been nurturing out just to make space to be able to straighten teeth. If we can straighten the teeth without having to do that, I think it, it is still the best way. They still teach extraction techniques and I couldn't understand it when I was in school. To me, it's amputating somebody's face. It destroys their profile. People that I know over the course of you know 25 years in dentistry is they have jaw joint issues, they have aesthetic issues, they, they can't chew, their teeth still get crowded. Obviously that's not the way to do it. With different techniques of orthodontics that I've tried over the 25 years, I've tried to find ways not to have to pull teeth. It's been a struggle. Fast braces doesn't believe in pulling teeth. The whole system is designed around making a nice, beautiful, healthy smile, working with the biomechanics of the mouth, making the muscles stabilize the teeth. 